You didn't tell Craig, did you? No. I didn't know who else to talk to. Oh, come here, girlfriend. I've completely humiliated myself. You tried it on. It didn't work out. It won't be the last time. Trust me. I was naked in his bed, Alice. I told him I was a virgin. <laughs> I wish I'd seen his face. He was revolted by me. Oh, rubbish. Trust me, I know guys, and he would have been tempted big time. But he said I was too young. And you are. Craig would have killed him. <laughs> oh, we could have kept it a secret. Well, people would know. How? Well, I can read you like a book. So can your dad, your brother, anyone who knows you. I'm so embarrassed. I know I have to see him, like, every day. Well, just be cool and act like nothing happened. It'll pass. Then how come I still feel so awful and why do I still like him so much? Look, TK's a honey and I can definitely see why you went for it. But it's not going to happen, so move on to someone a bit closer to your age. They're also immature. Yeah, takes guys forever to grow up. If you ask me, TK's still got a way to go. You reckon? You haven't seen past the board, girl. It's pretty damn perfect, but upstairs... But anyway, this isn't solving your problem. I just know the right guys out there for you. Gorgeous, funny, suave and debonair and filthy rich. We're for putting in an order, we might as well go for broke. Oh, and under 20. Oh, get me another brush, will you? Sorry, I've just finished my scrub. I'd have to start scrubbing all over again. And your point is? You've just started. You can get your own brush. I don't want to get my own brush. I want you to get one for me. This is ridiculous. Just do as you're told, girl. The hell with it! Get your own! Warmer. Well, 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 if it isn't the teenage heartbreaker himself. Sorry? Scarlet spilled her guts about last night. Don't get me wrong, you did the right thing. Of course I did the right thing. Oh, yeah, Craig's barely legal daughter. Oh, I never dream of going there. I don't even know how it happened. It's because she's so damn ugly. Hey. You're sex on a stick to a kid like Scarlet, and you know it. Man, she is suffering. Great. I'm talking zero self-esteem here. And hell hath no fury. Should I catch the next flight out of town or beg her not to tell anyone else? She's not a telltale kind of kid. I think you're safe. Anyway, I gave you some good advice. Thank you. And I'll give you some too. Tell her she's gorgeous and sexy and if she was a few years older, it would be all on. No way, man. That's creepy. And she'll think I'm still after her. Yeah, but her self-esteem will be sky high. Dr. Samuels, we have a problem. Not the one. Not the one. No, no. See, he just went nuts. Kia ora, mate. My name's TK. I'm a doctor here. So, what's your name then? It's all around us. It's all around us. He's here now. Here. Yeah, what's going on here? Now. I'm not sure on the loose. How about we go and get that cut sorted and casualty? He's here. He's here. Let him take me. Don't let Satan take me. Satan won't take you, all right? God is all around us. Look at this. Look at you, too. Then the best thing that we can do is pray, right? Will you pray with me? Pray. Yeah. Pray. Okay, yes. Yes. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Finished. Have I finished your case notes? Yes. Then it's time to review a few things. Like? I'm sending this into the publishers. Your last opportunity to have your name included. One minute, my name can go on it. The next, it can't. Whatever game is being played here, I'd like to know the rules. <laughs> How linear is the Confucian mind? No flair for the twists and turns of the complex narrative. I just wish you'd tell me what you want from me. I wish you'd tell me what you want. What do you mean, what I want? I want to be a surgeon. A consultant surgeon. To get that, I need a mentor, a patron. Someone to protect my career. You. Good God, woman, you've got a career. What do you want? No. I 
want power. Everybody wants power. I want power over Chris Warner. Total power. I want to shove that smug face of his into the dirt. Treat him the way he treats me. Warmer. Much warmer. The DHB meeting tomorrow. I want you there. Me? Why? You'll be right now, Barry. God bless. Yes. God bless. Thanks, sir. I know you meant well, so I'm letting this slide, but I don't ever want to see you letting your religious views interfere with your professional responsibilities again. Sorry? Well, the whole praying thing worked as a tactic temporarily, but it was completely inappropriate to use on someone going through a delusional crisis. I was only calming him down. He was d distressed and overwhelmed. Overwhelmed by his illness, not beset by devils or whatever. Schizophrenics often have religious visions. Playing to their delusional system is the wrong thing to do. It could have backfired on you really badly. I'm sorry, I still can't see how I've done anything wrong here. I'm telling you, you have. Find some time in the resource room, swat up on this stuff. And leave the religion at home, okay? I think that you did really well. Whatever. Some days I just can't win. Hi. You doing anything tonight? Okay, this has to stop. I made it clear we can't be together and playing dress-ups and acting all grown-up isn't going to change my mind. I'm going out, not asking you out. It's just being polite. Oh, I'm sorry, I got it wrong. But you, you must admit I had reason to think that you... didn't you... think, you jumped to conclusions. Scarlett, can we just forget about last night and go back to being friends? After you told me what you think of me? The fact is... The fact is, you're a little hottie. And if you are a few years older, then maybe we could... Do you know how much it hurts when someone lies like that? Oh, Scarlett... It hurts because the truth is that you don't think I'm a little hottie and you'd never want to be with me. Why do you have to keep saying it? 